West Africa, a land of vibrant cultures, stunning landscapes and hidden gems waiting to be discovered. From bustling capital cities to tranquil beaches and lush rainforests, this region offers a tapestry of experiences that captivate the senses. Our adventure takes us through Liberia, Ivory Coast, Ghana and Benin, each with its own unique charm. Prepare to be mesmerized by the warmth of the people, the rhythm of the music, and the breathtaking scenery. Our journey begins in Monrovia, the capital city of Liberia. Located on the Atlantic coast, Monrovia embodies the spirit of resilience. Despite numerous challenges, the city pulsates with life. The streets are a fusion of vibrant colors, delicious aromas from street food vendors, and the laughter of children playing. History comes alive at the National Museum of Liberia, home to artifacts narrating the nation's story. The abandoned Ducor Hotel stands as a haunting reminder of Liberia's past glories. Monrovia is a city on the rise, its people brimming with optimism and hope for a brighter future. Leaving Monrovia behind, we venture to the coastal town of Robertsport, a hidden gem. Here, time slows down as the gentle sea breeze whispers tales of tranquility. Robertsport is a surfer's paradise, its waves crashing in a rhythmic symphony. We watch skilled surfers dance with the waves, their boards gliding effortlessly. The beach stretches out, an expanse of golden sand kissed by the warm African sun. Palm trees sway gently providing respite from the heat. As the sun sets the sky transforms into a canvas of vibrant hues a moment of pure magic. Our journey through Liberia continues southward to the historic city of Harper. Once a bustling trading port, Harper is now a tranquil city steeped in history. The remnants of its colonial past are evident in the architecture, a blend of Liberian and American influences. We wander through the streets, marveling at the intricate details of the buildings. The old market, though quieter, still bustles with activity as locals trade their wares. Harper's rich history whispers through the streets, inviting us to imagine its former glory. Crossing into Ivory Coast, we venture deep into Thai National Park, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. This park is one of the last major remnants of the primary tropical rainforest in West Africa, a true gem of biodiversity. The rainforest reigns supreme, its emerald canopy stretching endlessly. The dense foliage forms a natural cathedral with sunlight filtering through the leaves creating a mesmerizing play of light and shadow. A symphony of sounds greets us, monkeys chattering, exotic birds chirping and leaves rustling. The cacophony of the jungle is both overwhelming and enchanting, a testament to the vibrant life that thrives here. We trek through dense vegetation, our senses on high alert. Each step is a discovery. As we navigate through the thick underbrush, the ground beneath us soft and damp from recent rains, the air is thick with humidity, and the scent of damp earth fills our nostrils. The atmosphere is almost tangible, a living entity that envelops us in its warm embrace. Suddenly, we come across a group of chimpanzees foraging for food. These remarkable creatures, our closest living relatives, move with a grace and purpose that is captivating to watch. We watch in awe as they interact, their intelligence and social complexity evident. They communicate with each other through a series of gestures and vocalizations, a sophisticated language that speaks of their deep social bonds. The forest teems with life, a humbling reminder of the interconnectedness of all living things. From the tiniest insects to the towering trees, every organism plays a crucial role in this delicate ecosystem. As we stand in the heart of this vibrant forest, we are reminded of the importance of preserving such natural wonders for future generations. Our next destination is Cascades Waterfall, a testament to nature's raw power and beauty. As we approach, we hear the roar of water crashing against the rocks. The air is thick with mist, creating an ethereal atmosphere. We stand in awe at the foot of the falls, dwarfed by their magnitude. The sunlight catches the mist, creating a dazzling display of rainbows. It's a truly immersive experience, a symphony of nature that rejuvenates both body and soul. We leave the rainforest and journey to Yamusukro, the political capital of Ivory Coast. The city is a stark contrast, its wide avenues and imposing buildings a testament to its status. Dominating the skyline is the Basilica of Our Lady of Peace, a colossal structure. Its white marble facade gleams in the African sun. Inside, intricate stained glass windows bathe the interior in a kaleidoscope of hues. Yamusukro is a blend of modern ambition and traditional values, a unique cultural tapestry. Our journey takes us to Ghana, a nation with a rich history and vibrant culture. Accra, the capital city, is a melting pot of tradition and modernity. 
The streets are a hive of activity, a cacophony of sounds and smells. Market traders hawk their wares, their voices competing with the honking of cars and Afrobeat music. We wander through Makola Market, a sprawl of stalls selling everything from colorful fabrics to traditional medicines. Independent Square with the Black Star Gate stands tall, a reminder of Ghana's fight for freedom. No trip to Accra is complete without a visit to Labadi Beach, a stretch of golden sand that seems to go on forever. This beach is not just a place, it's an experience, a slice of paradise where the land meets the sea in a perfect embrace. Here, the stresses of city life melt away, with the scent of salt and the sound of crashing waves. The gentle ocean breeze carries away your worries, leaving you with a sense of peace and tranquility that is hard to find elsewhere. Labadi Beach is popular with both locals and tourists, creating a vibrant and dynamic atmosphere. The beach is alive with activity, from beach volleyball games to people simply lounging and soaking up the sun. We watch children splash in the shallows, their laughter echoing across the beach. Their joy is infectious, reminding us of the simple pleasures of life. The golden light of the setting sun casts a magical glow over the scene, making it feel like a moment frozen in time. Fishermen mend their nets, their weathered faces telling tales of a life at sea. These men are the backbone of the coastal community, their daily toil a testament to their resilience and connection to the ocean. As the sun sets, couples stroll hand in hand, their silhouettes framed against the fiery sky. The romance of the moment is palpable, as the sky transforms into a canvas of brilliant colors, reflecting off the calm waters. The rhythmic beat of drums fills the air signaling the start of a night of pure magic and celebration. Around a roaring bonfire people gather to dance and sing, their movements and voices blending into a harmonious symphony that celebrates life and community. The night at Labadi Beach is not just an end to the day, but a beginning of new memories and connections. Leaving the coast we venture inland to witness the Twin Waterfalls also known as the Male and Female Falls. Located in the lush greenery of the eastern region, these falls are a testament to nature's power. Legend has it that the falls represent a man and a woman who chose to become waterfalls in death. The male fall, a powerful torrent, plunges from a great height. The female fall, more gentle, cascades down rocky steps, sparkling in the sunlight. Together they create a symphony of sound and motion, a testament to nature's enduring power. Our journey through Ghana's waterfalls continues to Boti Falls, steeped in legend and folklore. Located in the eastern region, Boti Falls is where the spiritual and physical worlds seem to thin. Legend has it that the falls are guarded by mythical dwarfs. Local villagers speak of strange occurrences adding to the mystery. The water cascades from a great height, crashing into the pool below with a thunderous roar. The air is thick with mist, creating a sense of otherworldliness. Our journey takes us to Benin, known for its voodoo traditions and vibrant culture. Lake Nokue, a vast lagoon, is our next destination. As we glide across the tranquil waters, we're greeted by a sense of peace. Fishermen cast their nets, their colorful pirogues bobbing gently. Villages built on stilts rise from the lake, their reflections shimmering. Lake Nokue is a sanctuary for bird life, with pelicans and herons adding to the serene landscape. Our final destination is Nikki, a city in northern Benin, known for its rich history and vibrant culture. Nikki is the heartland of the Bariba people, known for their equestrian traditions and colorful festivals. We arrive during the annual Ghani Festival, a celebration of Bariba culture and horsemanship. Horsemen, adorned in brightly colored robes, parade through the streets. The sound of drums and trumpets fills the air, urging the horses and riders on. The Ghani Festival is a spectacle, a testament to the enduring traditions of the Bariba people. As our journey through West Africa draws to a close, we find ourselves reflecting on the incredible experiences we've had. We're left with a profound sense of awe. From bustling cities teeming with life and energy, to tranquil beaches where the waves gently kiss the shore, and lush rainforests that echo with the sounds of nature, this region has captivated our senses in ways we never imagined. The vibrant markets, the aroma of street food, and the harmonious blend of old and new have left an indelible mark on our hearts. We've witnessed the warmth of its people, their smiles and hospitality making us feel at home even in the most unfamiliar places. The richness of its cultures expressed through music, dance, and art has been a feast for the eyes and ears. And the breathtaking beauty of its landscapes, from rolling hills to expansive savannas, has been nothing short of mesmerizing. West Africa is a region of contrasts, where ancient traditions coexist with modern aspirations. 
The juxtaposition of traditional mud huts and contemporary skyscrapers tells a story of a region that honors its past while looking towards the future. As we bid farewell, we carry with us the memories of its vibrant colors, infectious rhythms, and enduring spirit. The traditional ceremonies we witnessed, filled with symbolism and history, have deepened our appreciation for the cultural tapestry of this land. The vibrant colors of the local fabrics, the intricate patterns, and the artistry in everyday life have been a visual delight. We hope this visual journey has inspired you to see West Africa through our eyes, to feel the pulse of its cities, the tranquility of its natural wonders, and the warmth of its people. To explore the hidden gems of West Africa, from secluded beaches to remote villages where time seems to stand still and discover the magic that awaits. There's so much more to see, to experience, and to fall in love with. West Africa is not just a destination, it's a journey of the soul, a place that stays with you long after you've left its shores. Thanks for watching, please subscribe by pressing button below.